This video was brought to you by our sponsors, Hustlers Kung Fu Life Skills, where you can get 30 days to 2,500 for free. The link's below. Go ahead and do that. And also while you're down there, get the Hustlers Mindset, pimp your mind for success. And while you're down there, get the banking, the Oxygen Banking app to direct your 30 days to 2,500 money in that direction. So let's get into this wonderful bean footage. Today we're gonna to talk about some of the worst information out there. Follow your passion and you'll never work another day in your life. One of the reasons that so many people are unsuccessful is they're trying to find something fulfilling and entertaining. And I'm here to tell you, sometimes work is thankless. I love doing YouTube, but there's some parts of YouTube that I absolutely don't like. I'm not a fan of editing. I'm not a fan of well, some of these parts. And editing can be a really important part of YouTube. This is why from other channels, I've farmed it out. But here's the thing. What are you passionate about? And you will hear things like gaming, rap. You will hear fun things that will not lead to you making any damn money. See, passion is overrated. Mark Cuban said something, follow your determination. I'm gonna give you an example of how you operate and why following your passion is not a good idea for you and it's not something that's gonna put money in your pocket. Let's say you're driving and someone cuts you off and you get mad and you, is that passion? No, that's determination. It's like this, this, this effer cut me off. I'm gonna cut him off again. Funny story, the other day I passed somebody in the Porsche. They were driving a Hyundai and then, I mean, they almost broke their engine trying to pass because I I didn't even, I was unaware of what they were doing and they just jumped in front of me. It, it was kind of funny, but you know, it was a Hyundai. It, it, it was hilarious because I was in front of my subdivision. So I just turned in and I started laughing. But that's the kind of stuff that you need to do because when you're trying to follow your passion to create a life, what are you passionate about? Let me go ahead and tell you how this YouTube channel came to be and how it became successful. When I got in the storage auction business, I was not following my passion. I was following the money. When I had a job and I started my first company, GC Solutions, I was selling used office furniture. And then I had this wild idea that I would go ahead and convert that company to selling new office furniture. And I did like 1.5 million, but only made like $40,000 profit because I made so many mistakes, messed up so badly that I was like, man, so I sold $200,000 worth of used furniture and made $200,000 profit. And then I sold $1.5 million worth of new furniture and made $40,000 profit. I was like, hey, hey, <clears throat> we need to find some used stuff. And this is what led me to get into the storage auction business because once I went to the internet, once again, I wasn't following my passion. I was following was like selling used stuff has a really good budget it has really good margins selling you stuff so this is what took me to the storage auction business and this is what kept me into it because going to the auctions it bidding going up bidding against people did not become quote a passion until people started to piss me off remember what i said about determination remember what i said about if someone cuts you off and how you will be really aggressive and trying to cut them back off. Well, I was out at the auction trail and there was one of the whales, one of the auction whales, and he was just running me up on every unit. And this really pissed me off. It wasn't passion, but I was like, how can I get more money so I can tangle with this dude? And what I figured out was how to use Craigslist. Cause see, your determination leads you down paths. Your determination leads you into the appropriate areas. Your determination leads you to make the, the changes because it was my determination to find new stuff that led me to my storage auction. Then my, it was my determination to play the storage auction game well, which led me to eBay, Amazon, and Craigslist because most of them were not selling on those venues. So they gave me additional cash to go out there 
and throw down on the storage auction trail. None of this was passion. It was all determination. It was all about me getting better. So if anyone tells you, oh yes, follow your passion, look at their bank account, look at how they're living, look at their house. And like, that should tell you how the follow your passion thing will work. Cause right now I'm telling you, don't follow your passion, follow your determination, have a plan, be aggressive, be, go out, kill dragons, do what you need to do to make money. Because if you do not, you could like, th this is one of the things that I've seen with people who follow their passion. When, they, when their passion becomes work, they start to lose desire for their passion. I had a friend who used to make some wonderful cakes. The cakes were moist and delicious. And then, you know, so everyone kept saying, I was like, why don't you sell the cakes professionally? And then once she got into it on the professional level, she's like, I don't feel like making these damn cakes. It's just, you know, cause see the, the, the whole thing with passion and fun and entertainment and having fun is what I will give you a good example of how this really works. Like I said, she, she just got lost her desire to make cakes because she had to do it professionally. See, she it was in position to do it whenever she felt like it. And now that she had to actually do it consistently and do it over a period of time, that took the shine off of her cake making business, which was kind of wild. Now, let me tell you, when I first started doing YouTube, I hated making YouTube videos because making YouTube videos back in the day was nothing like it is today. You know, you only had like a 15 minute upload limit. You had to reduce the size of your, I mean, I had, I, I, it was, it was like an eight to 10 hour deal ordeal to upload one video for me. It, it was just, the process absolutely sucked, but I would make the videos because I did not like making videos. I did not like the process of editing videos. I did not like the process of uploading videos to YouTube. What I liked was the results. I started directing traffic from my to my blog from YouTube and I went from like six to 10 hits a day to two to 300 hits a day. And it, it kept growing and growing. So the more videos I did, the more traffic I got on my blog. So that was what kept me in it. It was my determination. I did not like making videos, but I love the results. So what I want you to do is go below, get 30 days of 2,500, go below, get the hustler's mindset, pimping your mind for success. That's all I got for you guys. Be sure to watch this next video.